Right, so here is our mock ball. This is our twisted cable stitch. And this one kind of looks a bit like a leaf once we get a few more rows on it. I have created one full repeat here and it is an eight row repeat. However, each of the reverse rows is all, are all the same. So the only difference is as we work our way across the front with our cabling, it changes as we move across. So we are going to begin with a purl stitch at the beginning of the row. All right, so to get started with our mock cable, we are going to insert our right needle into the back loop of our second stitch over. So we're gonna bring it, turn our work around, insert in through the back of the second stitch, bring our yarn around, yarn over, and now we're gonna bring our needle to the front and insert it normally. Okay, and then we're gonna loop off both the stitches which are now worked and this is going to create the twist so this basically moved the first stitch to the second position and the second stitch to the first position all right and then we're going to knit two more purl two and then that is our repeat so we're going to insert our hook our needle into the second stitch over work it through the back loop like that and through the front of the first stitch Loop them both off of our needles, off our left needle, knit the next two stitches normally, and then purl two and repeat. Now we're using the purl two to help these mock cables pop out of our work, and you can see that's happening here. And so we wanna actually accent on this mock cable section, okay? Now bring your yarn back to the back. Now our reverse row, working our way back the other way. I'm gonna knit the first stitch, purl four, knit two, and keep repeating that. So purl four, knit two, purl four, knit two, all the way across. And finally knit the last stitch. And now we can see what has happened with our mock cable. So there we're seeing it pull across this way into second position. Okay, now we're gonna keep working. Purl the first stitch. Now we're gonna shift our mock cable one stitch to the left. So knit one, and now we're gonna do the twist. So knit through the back loop of the second stitch over now, knit the first one normally, and then we're only gonna have one left to knit at the end of our leaf. Purl two, and then knit one. Twist over the next two stitches. So we're gonna keep working like this across this row. Do the exact same row we just did on the way back. And then our final row of the repeat is knit two, twist the last two of our four. And as always, this video will have the written pattern in the blog post, which is linked in the description below. And I will link back to day one of our 30 stitches in 30 days. If you're keeping track, this is day 21 and we're gonna keep going. You may already know, or maybe not. We did crochet stitches for the first half of the month. So the first to the 15th, and then we finished we're finishing the month off with 15 knit stitches. So there we go. Row number four is worked the same way all the way back. And then we're gonna do two knits twisting the last two of our four and purling the pearls. Okay, and then repeat our reverse row again and pretty much that's gonna be it. So we're gonna keep going. I'll be back in just a moment and we will go ahead and do that final row of our twist and show you exactly what it looks like. So we'll be, we'll be right back. All right, and to get started with the final row of our repeat, dart with a purl stitch and then we're going to knit two and then do our twist. And then follow by two purls and we repeat across the row. And that is the twisted leaf, this kind of mock cable stitch, okay? So I hope you guys like this one. If you do, go ahead and hit that like button below and down in the description below, you'll find the starting point for each of our videos for this 30 stitches in 30 days and the link to the blog post as well with the written instructions for this pattern. So go ahead and check those out in the description box below. And I hope you guys will join us for tomorrow's video. It will be nice and fun. So thanks so much for hanging out with us and we'll see you, we'll see you tomorrow.